Grace and blessings of the Lord be always upon you. Dear brothers and sisters in Christ Jesus, today, 22nd of October, the gospel is inviting us to be alert, awake and prepared. To be alert, awake and be prepared. When a soldier is out on the war, dear brothers and sisters, he is in the battlefield. Enemies all over, with a sword in their hand, shield in the other. The battle is happening. Does the person, the soldier, have an opportunity to take a break, to pause, to think, to prepare himself? No. Can he say, time please, I will put my lace. You missed a glance, you miss your life. He has to be alert, awake, fully prepared. No time for preparation in the battlefield. Dear brothers and sisters, we are in the battlefield. Those who are unable to look at the enemy and attack, or at least unable to defend themselves, they are losing their lives, their lives of faith they are losing. In the book of Ephesians, we see how St. Paul clearly speaks about the armor, about the breastplate, that is faith, that is the word of God, about the shield, about the sword, that is the Holy Spirit. All this is necessary. Be alert, be awake, be prepared. Because the enemy, the devil, is prowling like a roaring lion. How can I be alert in my life? How can I be awake? By keeping my eyes open. Yes, dear brothers and sisters, in today's world, this eye is leading many into sin. Our eyes, which are wide open, are helping us to close our eyes to the Lord. Eyes, when it is wide open to the serials, wide open to pornography, wide open to so many things of the world, becomes close to God. And that's how I am caught unaware. Do not say, I am still young. I have lot of time with me. No one has time. The time that you have is the time that you have. And let us use this time to be alert, become prepared, be awake, listen to the Lord, look at Him, look at Him, be with Him. And everything that He says, may those words work in our life. The child doesn't pass because the child knows the answer. The child gets good ranks only when the child writes the answer. Your alertness, your preparedness should make you to act in faith, to live in faith. Are I knew but I couldn't. You have to live in faith. So be alert, be prepared. Blessed is the person whom the master finds ready. The servant who is guarded for action. We are mere servants, servants of the Lord, ready to serve Him. If I am not ready, how will He utilize my service? Let's be ready for the Lord, ready to listen to Him. So give all ears to the Lord, ready to look at Him, give your eyes to the Lord, and ready to speak His words, give your mouth to the Lord. The more we keep our eyes, ears and mouth busy with the world, the more unready and unprepared we are. Let's be ready, alert, awake. Amen.